matrix. So, for class 7, biology chapter 3, plant life. Short and precise questions we will discuss first. This is our part 1. So, the first question is show the following processes in the form of flow charts. Number 1 is photosynthesis. The answer is light enters chloroplast of leaf cells followed by chlorophyll in, chlorophyll in grana captures light energy. Part of energy splits water into hydrogen and oxygen. Oxygen released into the air. Hydrogen carried to the stroma and stroma combines hydrogen and carbon dioxide to make carbohydrate. Number 2. Translocation. Water in the ground goes to the root, absorbed by root hair cells, goes to root cortex cells, pulled up by xylem, upward movement to the cells in leaves, diffuses through the stomata in leaves. Next, number B. Give reasons for the following statements. Plants are autotrophs. Plants are called autotrophs because they have the ability to prepare food by a process called photosynthesis. Number 2. Carbon dioxide is necessary for photosynthesis. Carbon dioxide is necessary for photosynthesis because as the amount of carbon dioxide in the air increases, the rate of photosynthesis also increases. Number 3. Leaves are reduced to spines in desert plant like cacti. The leaves in a cactus a plant are modified to spines to prevent the loss of water. Photosynthesis purifies atmosphere. Photosynthesis purifies atmosphere because it uses carbon dioxide and releases oxygen and thus it helps to clean the air. Number C. Answer in short. First number. Name the factors which affect the rate of photosynthesis. The factors which affect the rate of photosynthesis are carbon dioxide, water, sunlight and chlorophyll. Define respiration. The process of breakdown of food in the cells with the release of energy is called respiration. Number 3. How does photosynthesis occur in plants with red or brown leaves? In all such leaves, green color pigment is also present in addition to red or brown pigment. Photosynthesis takes place in green parts of all these leaves. Number 4. Give the word equation for aerobic and anaerobic respiration. Aerobic respiration, glucose plus oxygen gives carbon dioxide plus water plus energy. Anaerobic respiration, glucose gives ethanol plus carbon dioxide plus energy. Number 5. What are lenticels? Lenticels are small pores present on the surface of mature roots and stems through which exchange of gases takes place. So students, we are ending our short and precise section here. In our next slide, we will be discussing about from the at length section. Thank you.